Mythbusters star Adam Savage opened up about the death of his co-host Grant Imahara last year at the age of 49 from a brain aneurysm. Savage, speaking with Yahoo Entertainment Tuesday, said that he was gut punched by Grant's passing last year in July, which came about four months into the coronavirus shutdown. It felt like almost too much in the face of all the other existential crises that were going on, Savage said. But those of us that were lucky enough to know Grant knew him as a lovely man of honor, who wanted to share his knowledge with everybody. Savage looked back on Imahara's enthusiasm for his craft, as an electronics expert who had worked on multiple Hollywood projects such as The Lost World, Jurassic Park and in the Matrix and Star Wars franchises. My favorite memory of Grant is, every time an experiment went the way that it should have, he said, Grant expressed so much joy with his face. The Discovery Channel last July released a statement announcing Imahara's passing calling him an important part of our Discovery family and a really wonderful man. The network said, we are heartbroken to hear this sad news about Grant. Our thoughts and prayers go out to his family. Following his passing, Savage tweeted he was at a loss with no words about the tragic news. I've been part of two big families with Grant Imahara over the last 22 years. Grant was a truly brilliant engineer, artist and performer, but also just such a generous, easygoing, and gentle person, he said. Working with Grant was so much fun. I'll miss my friend Dottie Mahara's other Mythbusters and White Rabbit Project co-hosts Carrie Byron and Tori Bellacy both chimed in with condolences, as Brian said she was heartbroken and in shock while Bellacy said her she was heartbroken by the premature passing. Savage spoke with the outlet as Mythbusters is holding a charity auction to benefit a non-profit in memory of Imahara, the Grant Imahara Steam Foundation, 